Um, holy shit, look at his speed and research. This is all make a lot of money, but... Paula Owens has, like, crazy high crazy design. speed. Oh, is that... Wait, let me go... Okay, I see. Her research is low, but whatever. Tom references is uh, s faster and better research. Yeah, but no. He get Paula. I think Paula's... You're right. His tech's pretty high, just... too. I don't know. Mm. I could go either way. He's a lot cheaper. Let's do him. Okay. Oh, new research available. Large games. Nice. Triple A. I'm just going to put this out there. I think mm -hmm. Tom references. I think you should check his references. Because <laughs> that sounds like a fake name. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't seem... Wait, did he also just come in seem. with, like, an empty... Yeah, bar? He, oh, he, named, he immediately needs to make... Oh, wait, no, you have to train him. You have to train him. Oh, uh, okay. Wait, uh, what? Or do you have to... Sorry, not train him. You have to do oh, okay. his new employee... Product placement, oh, eh? Man, whatever. That, no, that seems great. Right, 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 you have to train Tom. I forgot about that. I'll pay yeah. you 200000 to play some of our fine red-painted exploding barrels in one of yeah, your no. games. Departure yeah, science. Of course. Want some test no, we don't need... That seems fine. We don't need... No, I already took it. It's too late. Great. Great. Clear trend towards adventure games. Make one right now. I can't. I'm you... still, we're still getting this engine. God damn it. <sighs> uh, if we hustle, we can do it. Medium boost. Fine. Medium boost, and we need to be have a game in development by the time we. Okay. By the time it and starts. Complete. Got right. an achievement for putting one million into an engine. All right, new game. You know our engines aren't ever really complete. Should we just make our own it. game? Yeah, until do we make sequel. a game with it. No, let's not do a sequel. We haven't been no, good it's with new sequels. game. New game. Um, what topic do we want? Guys. Wild West. Mm -hmm. Wild West. Detective? Uh, detective. Um, I love detective games and all, but I've heard stories about those costing a lot of money and people's jobs and lives. Yeah, and I've had good luck with Airplane. Let's do a Wild West okay. action. Action adventure? Just, or... just maybe just action. Maybe action adventure, maybe just action. Action sim. RPG? Action Adventure Action, is good. action yeah. Adventure, I think. Yeah. Uh, let's put it on the play system 2 is what I think. Filbrio. Brand new engine. Yeah. This is it, guys. This is it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, it's too late? Is it too late to move forward? Did you already move forward, rather? No, I haven't moved forward. Maybe... Uh, listen, we know that this is the end of the cycle. Maybe this is where we need to put in our pers Persona. Oh. Persona. So and it's not we, a wild we list. Do something else. <laughs> it's definitely not a wild list. Virtual game. pet RPG. Virtual pet RPG. <laughs> um, RPG simulation, right? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, do you do? Should that be for young kids or just for everyone? Or maybe it should be an. Hmm, I, maybe I it should be an RPG. Yeah. I think uh, everyone. Neon Goof New Threads. Philco Jobs page hints at potential pet management title. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, let's put in the exploding red barrels, as we were yeah. made to do. Great. Oh, wow. That's hilarious. That it's, it's uh, great. Okay. Uh, All right. Advanced cutscenes is good. Save game is yep. good. Mm. Basic physics will be good. Sure. Multiplayer, probably not. Let's put Probably it not. In. <laughs> we'll get achievements. Yeah, definitely achievements. Character progression for sure. Gamepad for sure. Um, oh, it would be a school RPG. It's too late. That's okay. Uh, James wants to put mod support, but I feel like mod support on the Play System 2 doesn't make sense. Yeah, I feel it like that makes sense. That's for a, that's PC a PC thing. Yeah, definitely. All right, here we so go. So, guys, are Neo Goof, uh, Neon Goof ship hosts. I can't believe Philco stooped to product product placements. Not even a Corgavania sequel. <laughs> Give me back now. Two hundred forty thousand. Not bad. Look at that hype. 
Oh, um, whoa. Hype is 52 already. We're doing good. That, we, mm-hmm. It jumped. I was Because I'm back a little bit in the stream, so I saw yeah, it jump yeah. from, our G, from our G3 booth. It jumped like 50 points, 40 points, something like that. You just have to make sure that doesn't plateau. Definitely put in mini games. <laughs> dialogue tree, what? Come on. Do you even. Yeah, dialogue tree. No. <sighs> Who are you? <laughs> Pet can't talk. <laughs> That's okay then, better dialogue. <laughs> Look at that hype. Hype is so high. It's oh. all those neon goof threads. So many neon goof threads. Um. Okay, 3D graphics we have. Surround sound. Yep. Virtual economy. <laughs> <sighs> God, this is this is a disaster waiting to happen. Auctions. What that? Auctions. He online said auctions. online auctions yeah. for personas. Oh no. Look at that hype. That hype is through the roof. Oh, God. Oh, guys. I'm, I'm rooting for this game. I really am. Silent Bum says, Neon Goof New Threads. New Corgivania game announced. Chinese free-to-play MMO by Tencent. <laughs> game. <laughs> new records. Oh, man, really? And our hype is through the roof. New combo. Not a good combo, though. Not good management. That's not great. But that's okay. I think... I, yeah, I don't... <sighs> Hype is a dangerous game, you know? Maybe it can carry it, but maybe it all... Oh, it can carry it. We can research orchestral soundtrack. That seems cool. Nice. Nice. Ooh. Also, I guess we should research large games. Yes, research large game. And, and listen, our first large game, let's do our first large game with a publisher. Yeah, of course. Let them... Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. It's, those don't look like big numbers to me. Okay, six is okay. What? That's a that's not okay. That's a fucking travesty. You saw those numbers. It's a travesty. I did those numbers. Right. Right. Tech and the design, those were new records. It's a travesty. They were new records. We got fucked. They fucked us. We got <sighs> fucked. And we had all that fucking hype. All that hype. People were so hyped. Everyone was hyped. Everyone was hyped. I was hyped. God damn it. Yeah, we, you're right. We should have had an embargo. <laughs> I told you. I fucking told you. James says we're the new Lionhead. Man. <laughs> all that hype. So much hype. <laughs> Listen, no, look, we're still making... more little tiny dog uniforms. <laughs> Cat uniforms, sorry. Fuck off, Dave Johnson. <sighs> what? God damn. What a dick. It's okay. We still have plenty of money. We're still rolling in cash from, uh... What, game 33? <laughs> Is that what it was? Game 33. Oh, uh, lord. Okay, let's see if we can find a publishing deal for a large game. CG Runyon says, you mean Cougar Torso, not Lionhead? Uh-huh. Alright. No, we don't have any oh. good publisher options available oh. right now. <laughs> what? You don't want to make a business RPG for the should N64? We, should we try a sequel? Should we do a sequel? Yeah, it's been a while. A, a Bark Souls sequel, maybe? Let's do a Bark Souls. Bark Souls 2. It's been a while, so... Oh! Uh, Tet Pio, Tet Pio King says, I want to see Bark Souls Online. I agree. Bark Souls Online. Bark Souls Online. The sequel to Bark have, Souls. We've got yes. the engine. We've got the online yes. engine now, right? Mm-hmm. We've got the online engine. Do we take this one to play tiny. System 2? No. Well, Keep it on I Mbox. Think... That's where the audience is. That's where the audience is. Yeah. Keep it on I Mbox. That you can't, that you can't do game. ports or whatever. Yeah, At this stage, you should totally be able to... 3D graphics. Oh, yeah. You made it large, right? Uh, no, I I, I uh, don't want to make it large yet. Okay, I'm scared. You're right. You know, I'm scared. We can't we can't put the bill on, our, on a large game. I agree. Okay, online play is on. <laughs> and multiplayer, right? Does that count? I guess online play is multiplayer. Yeah, that, it's right? you can only do one or the other. 
Okay. Okay. Good. Um, Which is, uh, you can only do you can only do multiplayer or online play. What couch co-op is dead? Great. <laughs> Our engine is going to need more more juice. Sawatoshi, yeah, uh, we're staying medium for this because we want to we want to make a publisher pay for the oh. the first large because otherwise it's just. I mean, cost it's not like they're footing the bill. It still costs us a fortune. We just get that flat fee up front, and that barely covers the development cost of like that's just sure. picking right, the fucking but, system. But it means, but it will get a wider. We'll get a wider. Uh, yeah, that's the thing is, you get the wider audience. So, so there's less risk. There's no way that we can make our engine. What do you mean? Work here. Why? Oh, because the engine is just super high. Get rid of just basic take physics. take off save games. Fuck it. Or basic physics. Okay, yeah. How many okay. MMOs have physics? Especially at this stage? That's fair. Dark That's Souls. Fair. Yeah. Well, shh. <laughs> they don't know. They don't know that. You need story a little bit higher, I think. Just a little bit higher. Nope. Too late. Whatever. Don't try to stop me. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Uh, add a dash. Uh, it was unchecked because we have online play on, and you can only have online play or multiplayer. Yes, that is accurate. Uh, also, joystick off because we have gamepad support. Right. Who uses a joystick on a, on a <laughs> console? Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Jared, Neon Goof, New Thread, New Bark Souls Online Trailer Showcases New Physics Engine. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Do voiceovers. See, Persona still made like 33.7 mil. Don't need mini games, obviously. Um. <laughs> I would hope not. Mini games in, in Bark Souls Online would send our fans just into a fit. Maybe, uh, I, yeah, we want voiceover. I want voiceover. Yeah, me too. I do. It's definitely getting more complex now with like having to balance everything. Yeah, this is this is good though. I like this. Again, this is this is where it differentiates itself from the basic ideas that were presented in game dev story, which are great. Definitely. But like this is there's just a lot more moving parts and that's really great. Uh, virtual economy, day night cycle, rich backstory, yep. open world. Yep. Open world. All oh my that. god, it's going to be so expensive, isn't it? I guess those aren't that expensive, but oh, I don't know who. All we right. We might have to get rid of day night cycle. We yeah, might have to get, get rid, rid of virtual we economy. We don't need the day night cycle. We don't need. But we need that. I don't know that you need the day night cycle. No, you don't. Need I the did. Day I got rid of that already. Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, and maybe, maybe open world. Yeah. Like, Bark Souls has an open world, but. It's not like a it's not like a GTA open world. Like maybe that's how this game means that. Probably not though. <laughs> Can you just bring graphics and sound down just a little bit? Oh man, it's just it's just not. You have to go down quite a bit to get it to. Yeah, you do. Ninety four percent world design. Fuck it. I don't know. Do how you that... really need the rich backstory? I don't know how that affects things. Oh, you... Is that? I think what because, it's RPG, because it's an RPG. Because it's an RPG. Yeah. You know, that's it doesn't understand. Rough. The backstory is so important. You want to know what's happening in the world of right. of Bark Souls. Bark Souls. <laughs> Yo, guy, uh, guys, we have such good design and tech right now. It's not even funny. <laughs> Jared says, "I love how legitimate the discussion currently is on the development of a fake video game." <laughs> <laughs> a bug snuck in. That's okay. We'll just patch it. That's why we have online support now. All right. If the critics fuck us on this, I don't even know what I'm going to do. I mean, I know really what I'm going to do. I'm going to write some really, really fucking angry emails. Right. Listen, I have... I don't, I don't want to tell you this, but I have a soft open account on Neon Goof. I'm going to go on there, and I'm going to just start saying some positive things. Kind of turning me. into a robot. Oh, sorry. That's okay. I still love you. 
Is it because of Marumba that you love me? Uh, a little bit. Okay. Oh shit. You guys. <gasps> oh no. Nope, nope, nope. One of nine. Nine is good. Yeah. Ten is better. Okay, okay. Oh, oh, oh man. Ten is good. On, I mean, games, of course, don't... all games. No, of course, all games is only going to give us a nine. Whatever. Yeah, it's, it feels good. <sighs> it feels good. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. I feel like Informed Games is the only place that's been our friend. You're right. You're right. <sighs> all right, we're selling. Oh man, we're making music games. Let's see what our publishing deals are. I really love to, to put out a large game. I really would. Give me one second. Sounds good. Finish these researchers. Yeah, the hype was not as high as I wanted it to be as James no. puts out. I, I okay. tried. I, I honestly consider blowing two million on a large campaign. I was like, you know, I better not. Yeah. We're over 500k in sales, and without a publisher, that's really it's good. It's going to make mm -hmm. money. Exactly. Okay. Good. Got to remember that, like, without a publisher, we need to make we need to sell a lot less to make a lot of right. money. Right. Mm -hmm. No one's one taking mil. A cut. Exactly. Okay. Let's. Mm -hmm. What are our publishing deals like right now? Business Doom RPG. We're not going to do start. This yeah. is all shit. This is all <laughs> shit. Damn it. They want us to make shit. <laughs> we need to start a new game before well, E3. Let's uh, let's do a brand new. Let's do a brand new medium game. Okay. We could do a large game. Fuck it, we're doing a large game. Oh my god, Phil. A superhero game. Superhero oh, no. action RPG. Don't make oh, it my. online, that always works out bad. Actually, <laughs> this time frame, you might... It might be fine. Yeah. I think superhero action, though. I think superhero action... Mm -hmm. Maybe action RPG. But it's action definitely... RPG for the M-Box. Okay. Maybe not RPG, maybe we should take that off. I think just superhero action game. Just yeah. Just straightforward. It'll be a movie tie-in. Like, what's a good movie out right now, guys? Uh, Iron Man three. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we're not making Iron Man three. No, we are. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I mean, it's going to be coming out in a little bit, so we could, you know, Great Gatsby. <laughs> Iron like Man three colon The Great Gatsby. <laughs> Got it. Basically, uh... the same person. <gasps> they are basically the same person. Mm -hmm. Jay Gatsby is basically Tony Stark. What's a way shittier metal than, than iron or copper? Tin. Tin man? That's already <laughs> fake. And Jay Conrad says ironic man. That's pretty ironic good. man's pretty good. Pewter. Pewter's pretty gross. <laughs> Pewter man. Zinc. Oh. Ironic man 3. Ironic man 3 is good. Um... Okay, I think this is all what we want. Listen, the studios came to us and they said, listen, we know you make the best video games. We know that you have diehard fans. <laughs> Sorry, Ender, Enderola in the chat room just did Ironic Man and then uh, a ridiculous emoticon that makes me really <laughs> happy. Uh, we'll throw in online play, of course. Um, right. No character progression in this. We don't need that shit. No, fuck that. Get that out of there. Gotta get those chivos. Yeah, okay, this all looks good to me. <laughs> Kamatoro and Sharp says, Guys, we know that irony sells. We got a deal for you. <laughs> oh, and he, perfect timing. We're at G3 now, showing off Ironic Man 3, as well as Bark Souls Online. This is when we've revealed it. You know, we know our fans love Bark Souls Online, and... We have something new for them. <laughs> <Jared. laughs> That's the joke. That's the joke. Uh, Neon Goof New Thread, Ironic Man 3 OT2. That's the joke. It's <laughs> good oh, stuff. Fuck, we're never gonna make it in the top 100 booths, you guys. Uh, Ooh, yeah, that I did think, not give us. I think we have like one or two. Two more office upgrades until that's realistic. Yeah. <sighs> Our charts have to look way different. I know that much. 
Oh, that's yeah, a good we, point. Large boots. Large boots next time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, we probably do. I just, it's, it's a lot of money. It is, but next time we'll do it, and hopefully if we're, if we're in the process of building you a really good game. a lot game, of money, too. Right, and if we're building a good game then, then it'll it'll hype us up, and it'll be great. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The timing will be just right, and everything will fall into place. Alright, what a... Uh... Alright, is this all is this all we want for this? This is all we want. This seems fine to me. All of this seems fine. Maybe lower uh, dialogue a little bit. Yeah, who cares? Who cares about the dialogue? Just drop that shit down. I mean it needs to be a little high for voiceover, but Right, right, right. But that should be uh, fine though. Oh we need The key Other is people. the level design. Beverly, get in here. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, listen, she's the dialogue queen. Wait, is Tom not working? No, Tom's working. Yeah, he's just been on... He, he took a vacation. He had to take a quick okay. vacation. But. Eight hundred seventy thousand for Barksles Online. I'm pretty happy okay. with okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's um, reasonable. Yeah, let's get Tom in here. On some stuff. Yeah. So to be clear, guys. So even if if Phil doesn't assign somebody specifically to work on a on one of these bars here, they're still contributing to the design and tech scores of the game. Mm-hmm. But to be extra clear, I am still going to fire Tom. It, okay. It's fucking. Up. He's gone. <laughs> really, Tom references isn't <laughs> pulling his weight. <laughs> this is with his made up bullshit name. Yeah. Uh, we don't need a rich backstory or an open world. We do need a virtual economy. That's <laughs> that's for fucking sure. Great. Gotta get those microtransactions, you know? Yeah, this seems all good. Oh, soundtrack, 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 soundtrack. Yeah. Uh, Slave 3, or Slav 3. Uh, ACDC. 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 He's yeah. right. He's absolutely right. Alright, now let's... I kind of kind of just want to do a large campaign. Fuck it! How much is it? Oh, great. Oh my god, Phil. Let's do it. Just do it. Oh man, that hype. That hype. Strong audience for everyone. Was this marked for everyone, Phil? Uh, I believe it is. Oh, Alright. Nice. Hype 200. Yo, hype 200. That looked like it maxed. Like it just hit 200 and stopped. And the stopped. Wall. Exactly. Uh, Deco Syndrome that's... says, but how much of the hype is unironic? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Park Souls Online has bugs. <laughs> oh, Fast Ed in the chat room says, neon goof, neon goof shit thread. Tom references is so right about wanting to leave company. <laughs> Can't wait till he releases a Super Beef Boy game. I wanna buy that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Parcels Online Runyon. only had one bug, to be fair. <laughs> CG Runyon informed gamer. Tom references makes fun of gamers in rural areas when asked about Barksels Online's free-to-play possibilities on Twitter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that's, that's, oh. New topic, new combo. Great combo. <laughs> Damn right. Uh... uh Nism, Nismo in the ch- in the chat says, "For the love of God, send Beverly on vacation. She's been working for four years on a day off." <laughs> Poor Beverly. She's gotta pay her dues. She's on the bottom of the food chain. Is she actually okay? She's going on vacation. <laughs> Poor Beverly. <laughs> I didn't actually see her bar. <laughs> Seven, a beautiful seven. I, I'm listen. It's a license game. We knew this was gonna happen. <laughs> Silent bum. Neon goof. New thread. Is Philco hurting Philco? Has he lost touch with modern day gaming? CG Runyon says, "Get your shit together, Beverly." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is uh, Gelb- Action Gelby. Action games in the chat, well in the chat makes a good point. This is not bad for yeah. a movie-based game. It's true. 
Neon Goof New Thread from Jared. More Philco employees speak out on unfair work conditions. I've never seen my child's face. <laughs> That's not true. We modeled those children's faces for the background action in Ironic Man 3. They've seen their faces just only as 3D models. Ooh, next, yeah, but we didn't gen. tell them that was their children's All right, here face, we go. so that doesn't this count. Is it. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Truly exciting leap forward. I'm excited. Fuck. Oh, yeah, we need to develop that patch. That's right. Oh, nice. I'm glad that's a thing. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's research skill trees. That seems important. Uh, yeah, I like those. It seems weird that you're just getting that now. I mean, I think it's been available for a little while, but... Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Jared is uh, nailing it tonight. I gotta tell you guys. <laughs> <laughs> what, is, what, what did he do now? Uh, Neon Goof shit posts. I bet if Beverly wasn't a girl, this wouldn't even be news. There are men in this industry who don't even know their kid's name. Oh. <laughs> Men's right advocates on Neon Goof. <laughs> Just. Uh, it's. Yeah, they exist. Wait, wait, what, this contract is just for movies? What's that even mean? You're making movies now. Oh, they saw great. what you did with, with Ironic Man 3 and they said, Hey, yeah. why don't you just make the next movie for us? Yeah, sales are not Save great. Save us a whole heap of hassle. Yeah, they, are, they aren't, uh, listen, they're not where I wanted them. I'm not happy. But I'm gonna do some contract work. Listen, also work. to be fair, the movie just bombed. So, yeah. that's not all that. Mm -hmm. I should have probably seen that coming. <laughs> Bark Souls 3, Mbox 360 launch title. Oh, I think oh. so. No, I think it's too soon. We have, to, we have to chill on that for a little bit. I think you haven't done Corey, handheld in a while. We haven't, and we can also do... You haven't catered to the kids, you know? You want to do a GS Cordyvania? I think that could be adorable. That would be Corgivania DS. Yeah. And people have been screaming for a Corgivania. Mm -hmm. It's true. Time. For just the longest time. So I'm sure that when it comes out, it will do amazingly well. That's the law of the internet, right? When people are really yeah. loud about something. Exactly. That's great. Guys, I'm just getting used to research points right now. I see that. Uh, Ironic Man 3 get, still gave us 5 million, though. Is yeah, That, that just goes to show you how... Ha, but how much did you spend on it? Publishers, fuck you, man. Like, we made, we the... made 2.2... <laughs> wait, that's 2.2k in profit. <laughs> <laughs> All of which we spent to send Beverly on vacation, like... <laughs> I thought it was 2.2 million at first. I was like, that's not so bad. <laughs> nope. No. No. Oh, God. Uh, I, I don't know, guys. That $2 million ad campaign Andrew Ola points out, that's really, really what it was. I, I fucked everything up. But if you hadn't done that campaign, how bad would it have been? Mm -hmm. You'll never know. Um. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm... I'm I'm actually gonna stop the stream, I think. Okay. Uh, thanks for five seventeen AM. Yeah. Thanks <laughs> for everybody who came in and watched. Uh, <sighs> we will be doing more of this this coming weekend as part of the uh live stream charity marathon that we're gonna be doing to uh try and raise some funds for Boston's one fund, which uh goes towards the victims of the Boston Marathon bombing. So if you're around this weekend, we're starting Friday at 6 p.m. Pacific. We're ending Monday at 2 a.m. Pacific. And uh, even if you don't have money to contribute, you should definitely come watch. It's going to be really fun. We have a we have a whole bunch of uh, a whole bunch of people who will be different people who will be streaming on this channel and joining in the insanity. So definitely join in if you can. Uh, <laughs> all right, guys. Uh, thank you for you watching. Plug, uh, I, yeah, I, I'm gonna save this and uh, please, please save this. Yeah, we're <laughs> gonna get back to this specific game because we're almost to the mm -hmm. next gen. We need to return to this. Uh, 
All right, so my, my name is Phil Kohler. I'm on Twitter at twitter.com slash pkohler. And uh, obviously, this is my Twitch channel. If you want to check out the archives of this stream, you can go to my YouTube channel, which is the same name as this Twitch channel, youtube.com slash kafkataren. Uh, Austin. I'm Austin Walker. I'm at Austin underscore Walker on Twitter. Uh, and I am, my website is clockworkworlds.com. Uh, I recently read a bunch of stuff on Bioshock Infinite. Go read that. All right, and Janine. Uh, I'm Janine. I'm at Bleating Heart, B L E A T I N G Heart on Twitter, uh, and sometimes I write stuff and post it there. Awesome. All right. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good night. Peace. <laughs>